that we need to be conscious of the tax that we are putting on our businesses because we do need to attract businesses in here. So that would be my thoughts. I would just like to say that um, just because something appears as a category three doesn't mean it's not important, Absolutely. right? And 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 I and I think it's it's um, it's how the administration has prioritized it. It doesn't mean it's not important. Um, and again, I, I think our charge, when you look at what we're doing with school, as a school board member, if you read the roles and responsibilities of a school board member, it is to be supportive and cognizant of what's going on in the public. But I don't see anything in our charge, which is children first every day, that would deter us from not making that decision to raise the full millage. I just don't. Um, I'll, 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 you said you want to, I want to toot Dr. Fratarelli's horn because uh, not only for his efforts in the school district, but for a lot, most everybody in this room, my kids are benefiting from an amazing school district. So toot. Um, and, <laughs> I, I, sorry, I, I'll take it. <laughs> All right, is that on the, yeah. But uh, Dr. Frat, I will respectfully somewhat disagree with, with Dr. Frateroli in that we've got to pay attention to the environment, the, the, the environment that we're creating in Fort Mill. And, and that's my concern, is that um, yes, we can reach and get some more. And, and maybe that's the right thing, maybe it's not. However, it's really just children first every day, but it's if we're gonna create a tax environment that makes it unwelcome to be in Fort Mill, then long term, that's a detriment to all of us here, and that's my concern. I've got a couple questions. Sure. Um, 